For the first time in Antigua, a dance seminar featuring internationally renowned modern dance instructors was held through the efforts of Joanne Bento of the Dance Center. For those involved in the performing arts in Antigua, particularly in the field of dance, there's always been a demand for professionally trained dancers to see the technical level of Antiguan dancers raised to international standards. Well, uh, clearly the potential is there, but uh, I, as we, uh, me and my, our my colleague, dancers, teachers, we feel that though there's a potential, but I think they need to, to get some real training you know, to develop that potential. The potential is just something that we have until it's being uh, nurtured and, and, and um, developed, you know, it doesn't mean a thing. The Dance Center held the workshop with an open invitation to the local dance community. Some took the challenge and both young and senior dancers turned up for the five-day workshop. Well, uh, I thought it was very hard work, but very worth it, especially as a teacher. It's good to be in class with the students. So there's a level of humility that goes along with it that pushes the technique and pushes you as a teacher to do better and develop your technique. And I think we get a lot out of that. While most Antiguan audiences tend to prefer contemporary dance that involves a lot of folk or Afro-based movements, for serious dancers, modern technique is a solid foundation to build on. It was a wonderful experience for me. I've never really had a lot of exposure to modern dancing before and ballet. So coming to this workshop has given me so much more to reach for in terms of dancing. And I am looking forward to doing more of this, especially when I go off to school. And what I really enjoyed was, as a dancer, there's no such thing as doing one type of dance. I thought it was very challenging for once. And the modern week, most of us hasn't haven't done it before, so I guess it was very nice. The test of a good dancer is to make the difficult seem effortless. This takes a lot of strength, stamina, and hours of practice. The curtains came down on the first international dance seminar in Antigua with plans to make it an annual event. All the participants considered it a success, and though tired, eagerly anticipate the next workshop. It was hard, hard and more hard, but it was challenging, you know, we learned a lot, you know, we, everybody improved everything, it was great, you know, I was kind of waiting for it to be over, but now, you know, I'm kind of sad it's over, so it was really great, great experience to be taught by professionals and stuff. It's really a good experience. I felt it was very successful and I'll be honest with you, I'm just really grateful for those parents who you know, were able to send their children and I really feel that next year we will have another event and I think it will be that much more successful. Well, I, I, I feel it's been a, a great success. We've enjoyed the, the, the students so much. They're so enthusiastic and willing and, and happy to learn. You know, that it's, uh, it's kind of an inspiration for us too, it really is. The workshop, it's been a, it's been a tremendous success uh, in terms of uh, the people from Antigua coming to it. You know, I never expected such a response, especially for the modern. This modern in France is not a word well known, and here I'm so happy that it's worked so well. You know, fantastic numbers, fantastic attendance. We hope you can make it better for next year and uh, to have add, add additional um, disciplines, hip-hop, African dance, and other dances we can, you know, to, to create it into a real international workshop, yeah? Caribbean style. At the end of the five-day workshop, the dancers got a chance to showcase the skills that they learned.
really think that something like this is really needed and it should continue in Antigua because the more we get the younger ones to get involved in this type of training, the more quality dancers and dance teachers we'll have in Antigua. So I'm just hoping that I'll be able to take it a step further and use this workshop as a stepping ground to where I really want to go in the future as a dancer and a teacher. It was wonderful.